this award certainly means a lot uh, to me. It is a great honor because I'm from the scientific group that has been founded by Jakov Zeldovic himself and a great number of my colleagues have been awarded by this medal before. It is a signature of belonging to this group uh, for me for sure and it is also a recognition of my efforts in uh, preparation and work on the data of uh, space observatories, X-ray observatories in particular. And I'm very grateful to the team of uh, people, to whole our group that supported me uh, and allowed me to, to get the results uh, from, from, from the data and also from the theoretical side. Uh, first of all, uh, Rashid Sunayev, Eugen Churazov and uh, Sergei Sazonov. So I'm very grateful to these people. Uh, who taught me a lot and uh, allowed me to do my best. I would start from uh, the characterization of the unique galactic microquasar SS-433 and also populations of X-ray binaries in the nearby galaxies and also estimation of their role in preheating and reionization of the universe. Uh, the second one, I guess, would be a re exploration of uh, the past activity of supermassive black hole Sagittarius A star and molecular gas in the center of our galaxy. And finally, uh, I would uh, say it is um, work on the of, on preparation and actual data analysis of the spectrum RG. Uh, observatory and the telescope Irazita into, uh, regarding galaxy clusters, galactic diffuse emission and extragalactic X-ray transients. So the COSPAR assembly in Mysore in India in 2012 was one of my first big international conferences where I uh, got an opportunity to present my work and also to uh, get into the community so and I was really very, very impressed by by the organization and by the whole uh, variety of the topics covered and uh, the, the the community work that took place there since then I also was involved in in the next assemblies and uh, had a chance to to present some part of our work so I, I guess that um, Kaspar is really a great support for, for a great number of directions. And also, just recalling my first conference, I, uh, I knew a lot of people from that time, so as it typically is. So they are my good friends now and they, they help me to, to go through my career and we support each other. So it's kind of a great great opportunity to know other people what they do and also to, to present your work. Yeah, I have a couple of advices. Maybe the, the first one is uh, do not spend much time on some temporary solutions trying to get uh, things fast. Just invest time in uh, longer programs that will help you in future. The second one is uh, listen to people with more attention and try to understand what, uh, what way they have done on, and what they have understood themselves. So because science is a collective effort. And finally, just enjoy science, enjoy what you do. And uh, this is also one of the most important things, I guess. Well, I, I would try to keep working hard, especially in the direction of the new X-ray missions. And uh, right now we are working hard on the Spectrum RG Erosita data, which provides us with a great number of new discoveries. So I, I plan to, to, to improve on the uh, work in this direction and also to support more future X-ray facilities and future CMB facilities that will help us to answer such key questions as the nature of dark matter and dark energy.